When I first heard Mac DeMarco's My Kind of Woman, I thought to myself, huh, this is pretty good. Not amazing, but pretty good. I proceeded to completely forget about it. A couple days later, I was bored and sitting in my room with nothing else to do, and I decided to revisit it. That's when I saw the music video. The video, the one playing in the background right now, changed the song for me completely. It's a glimpse into the world of a hopeless romantic and potential stalker as you experience his breakdown firsthand. It gives the viewer the sense of calm before the storm, a certain shadowing eeriness that never really leaves you. Creeped out wasn't the only thing I was feeling, however. It was something odd, yet familiar and warm, and I couldn't put my finger on it until a couple days later. It was the same feeling I got when I first saw the music video for Guns For Hearts by 21 Pilots. It was a feeling of utter inspiration. It made me want to create. It made me want to make something as good as what I just seen. And as I dwelled on that feeling, it made me realize. Music videos are important. Really important. I know it seems a little redundant to emphasize praise on something that is so predominant in today's culture, but I began to notice something troubling. They're being commoditized in a really heartbreaking way. More and more, the music videos of today are becoming separate entities to the music, built around selling a product or superstar, and not just in the world of pop, but the indie scene as well. Most of my favorite bands rarely even put out music videos anymore, and when they do, it seems to be completely unrelated to the music it's put to. It's rushed, and perhaps more troubling is, it's background noise. Mostly there just to draw attention to a product, whether that be the music or an actual, literal product. And while I do understand that commercialization will happen with anything popular, after seeing so many amazing projects, it scares me to think that the art of the fantastic music video might die off one day that money will win out over Masterpiece. So, as a token of hope, here's a hurrah for all the amazing, life-changing music videos that all kinds of artists have put out. The fan-made ones, the mainstream ones, the underground ones, the school projects, and most importantly, the ones that aren't out yet. If you're a filmmaker, or just passionate, or even just bored, make art. Keep it alive. It's in your hands. Just make sure it doesn't slip through your fingers.